Hey guys, Molly here and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be doing the um there is the booktube a thon and the bibliothon and I'm doing both of them. So yeah. Um so I'm combining the challenges. Sorry, my I'm talking really softly because my throat I was sick and my throat's still sore so and I had to film this so sorry if I'm talking really quietly um so the the bibliothon the biannual bibliothon which is the summer one that challenge is read from a host's favorite genre and I have I don't know her name but um her one of her favorite genre is sci-fi slash dystopian and then the book tubathon challenge is read a book with a person on the cover so the book that i chose is the program by suzanne collins um i'm very excited to read this um people say mm, there isn't really a lot of talk about this book but it sounds really good and it looks really good and yeah but yeah there's two people boy and a girl on the cover and it's a dystopian so sci-fi or dystopian this is dystopian so yeah um the next challenge is read a book that has that has been or still is banned and that is for the bibliothon and then the book tubathon challenge is read a hyped book um and that book is harry potter and the deathly hollows um i i haven't completed the harry potter series yet so this is finally finishing it yeah i'm currently reading it but like oh well um so yeah this is a banned book i don't know if it's still banned but it was well the harry potter series was banned and then this is a, the Harry Potter is, the Harry Potter series is very hyped. So, yeah. And the next challenge is for the Biannual Bibliothon, and it is a throwback challenge, and it's a book from an author you've never read before. And the book Tubathon is finish a book in one day. So, the book I'm choosing is The Wrath by S.A. Boating. Um... I've never read a book by her. I think it's a her. Um, no, no, it could be he. But, um, and then this is a short book, so I could probably finish it in one day. I'm hoping. I'm not 100% sure. So, yeah. Um, and then the next challenge is read a book to movie adaptation so like read and watch it um that's biannual bibliothon and then booktubeathon is read about a character that is very different from you um and that book is eclipse so i haven't finished my twilight series um i say i'm gonna read this so many times and never do so i'm just like whatever i'm gonna probably try to read it but this is a big junk of a book and I don't read that fast, and I can't read a book in one week, because procrastination is real. Um, I could if I, like, sat reading, but, like, I don't because I get bored easily. It's not like I get bored easily, but, like, I do get distracted easily. So, yeah. Um, so I have the movie, <coughs> movie on the DVR for this. Um, it's recorded, so I can watch it. And then this is the read about a character that is very different from you. Um... Bella is in love with a vampire and I'm not so that's different for me so yeah <clears throat> and then the fifth challenge for the biannual bibliothon is read a book you've seen somewhere else other than booktube um I mean obviously I've seen this on booktube but like I've seen it somewhere else so um and then booktubeathon is read a book completely out doors so that book is going to be 
Anna and the French Kiss by Stephanie Perkins. Um, I've seen this on Bookstagram, seen this on Goodreads, and everything. So, yeah. Um, I can read this completely outdoors. This is not going to be fun because it's always 90 degrees in Florida. So, yeah. Um, and then the next challenge is for the Booktubeathon. I don't, um, well, the next challenge for the Biannual Bibliothon is reading an LBGQ book, but I don't have any. So, yeah. But the Booktubeathon challenge number six is read a book you've bought because of the cover. Um, I don't. I mostly buy books because of the, I like the plot, um, but if they have a good cover, then that's a bonus. Um, but I mean, I look towards, like, if I see, oh, it has a good cover, let me look at the plot. So, yeah. Um, and that book is This Is Where It Ends by Mariki Nikonamump. I'm not gonna... Damn. Okay. Um... I love the cover because it's so like, um, it's plain but like, shh, cool at the same time. I don't know. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm very excited to read this. One of my hyped reads that I really want to read. So yeah. And then the very last challenge for the books we were on is read seven books. So that book is going to be All in Pieces by Suzanne Young. Um, I'm very, very excited to read this. I actually got these books together at the same time on tar at Target. So, yeah, I'm very excited. Um, and everything. So, yeah, which, I, I don't know how I'm going to read seven books. I only read two books last year at the book do -a and that was my first year, and this is my second year doing it, and that biannual thing all the time. I was going to do the winter one, but I forgot. I didn't forget, but, like, no, no motivation to do it. So, yeah. Alright, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe. And make sure you hit the subscribe button. Give it a big old thumbs up. <coughs> and make sure you comment down if you're doing the book with on and what books you are reading. I would love to know. Um, and everything. Bye, guys.